Hey guys, I just released some steaming hot new merch. Steaming hot items, as you can see, and uh, I really love it. Hope, hopefully you do as well. And uh, thank you if you purchase some. Thank you also for watching this channel and for, for continuing to support me. I very much appreciate it. Okay, on to the video. Okay guys, today we're gonna learn about Riz. <laughs> That's not the most millennial way to start a video in the entire world. Today we're gonna learn about Riz. What the heck is Riz? I know, you know, people get sick of me saying that word Riz. It's a little cringe for me to be saying Riz all the time, but there's a lot of people risen, you know, displaying Riz on TikTok, so we're gonna learn a little bit about it. <clears throat> we got a collection of bad Riz that we're gonna wince at, and we got a collection of potentially good Riz. So, in a sense, this is kind of the Riz Academy. Riz 101. I've said Riz too many times, it means nothing to me now. Riz, 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 Riz. Okay, let's get into it. Um, you don't need Halloween, uh, because- Oh good, a hidden camera video. I fucking love these. I love watching people talk to random people in public without their knowledge. Because you're a treat every day. Aw, thank you. Do you think I can get your Instagram? Um, I don't have Instagram. Your phone I... number? Mm, probably not. Okay. I'm sorry. Have a good have one. A day, <laughs> <laughs> oh wait, this this account's actually called Riz Academy. <laughs> I mean, I would say that wasn't too bad of it. <laughs> it was pretty bad. She said, "I don't actually don't have Instagram." I was waiting for her to say, I don't actually have a phone number when he went, okay, what's your phone number? I'd actually, I'm off the grid. She let him down sort of easy. You know, she laughed at his joke and it wasn't too bad. Hey cutie. Sorry. Hi. Uh, I like your vibe. It's showing like adventurous. Oh my God. Oh, right away. Hey cutie. Sorry. Hi. <laughs> oh my God. The way she's just dodging him. Just sorry. Sorry. Just. Not, not even like picking up on the fact that he's trying to talk to her. She's just like, oh, you're in the way. Uh, I like your vibe. It's showing like adventurous. Do you know what this is? Uh, like a old telephone that I know. Yeah, and the only, th the only thing, it's like it's not working because I don't have your phone number. Uh. <laughs> you think I can get your phone number? Oh, fuck, dude. That laugh. Phone number. Uh. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. <laughs> That was the most forced laugh I've ever heard. No part of her actually wanted to laugh there. I don't have your phone number. Uh, <laughs> uh, oh, hey. <laughs> hey, cutie is crazy. <laughs> hey, cutie. <laughs> Just to a random girl you don't know. Hey, cutie. Hey, cutie. Oh, sorry. That's how she responded to that. Sorry. Get out of my way. Damn, I just spent 30 bucks in there. But... Excuse me. Hey, excuse me. Can I get your number? No? Can I get your hey, can I get your number? I have a boyfriend. Can I get your number? Um, I have a boyfriend. Can I get your number? I'm lesbian. Can I get your number? Holy fuck! This man is rapid firing. This guy is a stats man. He knows. He knows the stat. If you hit on a hundred girls, you'll get rejected 99 times, but one of them will probably say yes. He knows the fucking odds. So he's just hitting them quicker than everyone else. Number? Can, hey, can I get your number? Actually, I'll have one. Can I get, yo. He's just asking dudes. <laughs> Spraying and praying, dude. He's not even aiming anymore. He's just at anything. Uh, no, Excuse me, can I get your number? No. Can I get your number? 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 At least he's not being annoying. He's asking one question. One harmless question. Can I get your number? Nope. Okay, he's moving on. That's ideal. Can I get your number? <laughs> Fuck yeah, dude. Zero for 20. Wow. What a rage. Guys, what's the coolest thing in the world? One, two, three. Websites! Exactly! I could hear you say that from here. As many of you probably know, I am the creator of the number one app in the world that has ever been created, and that's I'd Cap That, an app I made in 2012. When it comes to technology, I think I know what I'm talking about. Creating a website from scratch can be challenging, and in 2023, that's unnecessary. And now with Squarespace, the sponsor of today's video, it's not. Squarespace is a one-stop shop for anyone that wants to stand out or succeed online. Now, what does that mean? Well, that means if you want to start a brand or manage or build a brand, for example, 
Squarespace makes it easy to build beautiful websites, engage with your audience, and sell anything from products to content to time. My favorite part about Squarespace is how easy it is to get started. You start with a professional template and then you customize it so that it suits your specific needs. And then boom, you're done. My next favorite thing is how many things you can actually do with Squarespace. You can use it to build a simple landing page for whatever you want, you know, for an event you're having or just a, just a picture of you, your name.com and then it's just a picture of you and that's it. Or you can use it to build an e-commerce store to sell your jar, your farts in a jar, for example, just such as an example. Or create a portfolio of videos and photos to show your work if you're an artist of some sort. Squarespace helps you do all that in one place. Not that jarring your farts isn't art, I think it is. I'm just, you know, it was two separate examples. You can do anything, that's what I'm trying to say. So if you're interested in learning more and supporting this channel, just go to squarespace.com for a free trial. And when you're ready to launch, go to squarespace.com slash Cody Co to save 10% off your first purchase of a website or a domain. Boom. All right, back to the video. Hey, excuse me? Can you, can you turn, excuse me? Ah, uh, already, oh fuck. Look at this face right here, look at, just not a good start. I'd say right now, this is, you're not, you're not starting off well, excuse me? Excuse me, can you turn around, please turn around? I'm trying to hit on you, please turn around. Uh, I have a question, I'm trying to, oh my God, you're beautiful. I'm trying to get your number. No. Why do people post these? Like this is not even inspirational. I feel like if like if someone was watching this to like get inspired to go out and talk to random girls, this would deter them from doing so. Like I'm saying like if someone was watching this to get to work up the courage to maybe talk to talk to someone that they've been meaning to talk to or something like that, this would probably deter them from doing so. Is it cuz I'm ugly? Oh fuck. Why did you post that? Is it because I'm ugly? She went, yep. Oh, fuck it. Oh, knife to the heart. This is worse. I mean, there's this is the only thing worse than the button is getting rejected like this. Oh my God, you're beautiful. I'm trying to get your number. Even that, she was like, she's not even, she's like, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, wait, this is Confident Chris. Oh my God, I already did a video on this guy. Oh, let's watch some more here. Excuse me, miss. Hey, I know the gym isn't the place to, you know, meet somebody, but uh, we could just. Oh, fuck, man. Oh, man. This is like actually, I, like, I'm so seasoned right now and watching this shit, but this is like, this is taking it to a new fucking level, man. I'm not having fun. Yeah, yeah, that's right. You'll be happy to know I'm not having fun. We could just tell our parents we met on Tinder or something. Sorry? I know this isn't the place to, like, meet somebody. Though I don't know what it is about like the sorry and then having them having to repeat it. Same with the last one. Excuse me. Excuse me. Like it just rockets up the cringe. Like the gym, but we could just tell our parents we met on Tinder. I don't understand what you mean. Ah! Fuck. This is the worst video I've ever seen in my entire life. Like this is not a place to meet someone, but what? But we could just tell our parents we met on Tinder. Tinder. Yeah, Tinder's like a dating app. Okay. Yeah, so can I take down your number? I'm and... not trying to date anybody. Uh, I'm not trying to date you too. We could just go wash our cars or something like that. What do you mean? Like wash our cars. It's also a workout. Wash cars? Wash our cars, yeah. <laughs> no. Are you interested or no? No. Oh, okay. You have a good one. I actually can't believe that. Out of everything I've seen in 10 years of doing this, that's the worst. Holy fuck, man. Like if there was a scale of like, okay, like on this side, it's like a girl like responding well to the pickup line and you getting their number. And then, and then there's like hearing the pickup line and laughing, but not giving you their number, right? And then it's like not responding well to the pickup line. And then it's like, doesn't really say anything, doesn't really respond. At least in all of those, she like, understands what you're trying to do. This, this was like down here, like over here. If I, I mean, like, let me just run even further. You're over here. You're all the way over here. Fuck, sorry, I had to run back. She wasn't even close to understanding the pickup line because of the way he like stumbled through it. I mean, I, I don't even think she still, she didn't understand any of that. What? We can we tell them we met on what? I've, what, wash what? What are you saying? 
Oh my god, that was a journey. So I was just looking at the dog and I'm like, damn, that's a cute owner to be honest. I'm engaged. Oh, for real? Yeah. No ring or nothing? I have it, it's not on. Yeah, I, it'd be like that too. I, I don't like to wear it either. Uh, so I was just looking at the dog. And I'm oh my god. Oh my god. Blood tried to riz the dog. <laughs> He basically did that at the end. He's like, yeah, no, I'm married too. I'm not, I'm not trying to hit on you. I'm trying to hit on your dog, all right? I think your dog's fucking sexy, all right? Not you, you. So you think you can get a boy's number or Instagram right now if I choose somebody? Yeah. Yeah? Oh, you confident. I like that. Right here in the shorts. That's light. That's be light, yeah. That's light. Why is everyone that uses these mics, they're turned up 500,000 decibels? Like, they're always just clipping to the max degree. Get somebody stumble right now if I gave the gave you a hundred dollars like gee like gorilla? Hey yo, relax. The girl, what's your best pickup line? I'd say what are the ten digits of yours that make me ring? Oh god. Okay, can I pick a girl and then have you say that and get the number? Sure, you can try that. I I hope I get it. Here, I'm gonna put the mic on you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so like it's a nice snowy day, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I was wondering, like uh, what are the ten digits of yours that make me ring? Thank you. Uh -huh. It's okay, bro. Shoot or shoot. Shoot or yeah, shoot. Yeah, yeah. Shoot or shoot. Shoot or shoot. shoot. Keep shooting. Uh, <laughs> that one was like kind of. That one was like kind of heartwarming, honestly. Like he, he had. That was actual confidence. She let him down a little bit easy. She was like, "No, thank you." And then he was like, "Ah, oh, fuck it." That was innocent. That was great. I feel like it's this dude's fault for kind of setting him up a little bit. He should have been like, "Listen, the line doesn't really make sense." But he was like, "Yo, uh, yeah, say that to somebody." <clears throat> like that guy's kind of a dick. But he's a nice guy. You can tell. I approve of the Riz. That's see that to me. That's good bad Riz. Secrets to picking up any girl at any time. I'll show you right now. Um, hey, excuse me. Mm -hmm. Um. So, basically, I'm sorry if you're, uh, well, I guess I don't know. I just saw you, but hypothetically, well. Oh, fuck. Wait, this is, this is bad, right? This is intentionally bad? Since I just saw you, and I guess we don't know each other, but, yeah. you know, if, I guess necessarily it. Uh, <laughs> this is good. This is good. <laughs> this is good. I can't, uh, if we put it into words, but, um, if you. If we could, kind of, if, um... Dude, this is, uh, this is... Damn, I just drooled. There's a little bit of drool right here. Because he's just rizzing so hard. N necessarily, in a, in a way, I don't know how it would work, or your plans, but if we were to, uh, I guess, you know, kind of, um... See, this is like, this is basically the same shit as what Confident Chris does, but this guy is like meaning to do it. Like, it's a joke. But that was essentially the same thing as the gym video. Literally. Uh, we could be on Tinder, or we could tell people that we met on... We don't have to tell people that we met on Tinder, or what? What? Sorry? Sorry? What did you say? Oh, did you, oh, you have six husbands? Okay, sorry. It just makes you a dull-ass hoe. Me? Yeah, are you. How does that make me that? What do you mean? Why does it make me that for not kissing you? Because anyone here would. Really? Yeah, I bet. Watch this. All right, go get wait. a guy. Prove it to me. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Watch this. They kiss me for me. <laughs> fuck them! Bye! Oh. Oh, fuck. That was bad. I would never run for women, but for you two, I might jog. <laughs> that was a good one. <laughs> I would never run for women, but for you two, I might jog. That was a good one. <laughs> no, it was not a good one. It was not a good one. I would never run for women? That doesn't even make sense. What does that mean? I would never run for women? Who said, that's not even a phrase. Is it? Am I just stupid? Am I stupid right now? Am I being, am I being dumb? Excuse me. If I get bit by a spider, I become Spider-Man. If you bite me, can I be your man? No. The delivery in these is so horrible. Like... He's just speeding through them, you know? If you're gonna disrupt a random person, which you probably shouldn't do, no woman wants to get hit on on their fucking way to class or whatever they're going to, you know? But if you're gonna do it, you might as well try and, like, try and put a little, like, fucking... Excuse me, like... <laughs> I don't know why I'm doing... Why am I... Excuse me. But, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, like, 
you know, draw it out a little bit. Like, listen, if I get bit by a spider, I become Spider-Man. Then what happens if you, no, this is worse. This is worse. He, you know, you should just speed through them. Get to the no as quick as possible and move on and then post the video, you know? Excuse me. If I get bit by a spider, do I become, no, I become Spider-Man. If you bite me. <laughs> uh, no, uh, sorry. Uh, wait, um, sorry. Uh, the Joker, er, uh, um, um, you, uh, I guess you would be the spider in this scenario, or what, uh, sorry, the end of the line is fucking forget, uh, oh yeah, you should bite, bite me, my, uh, dick off, or bite my dick off, or what am I saying? Can I be your man? Um, that was a good lie. <laughs> I'll give you that. Um, you are, I don't. I love the way he cuts them off. It's like, yeah, just the the focal point, the part you should be focusing on is my terrible pickup line, not the girl's reaction. Excuse me. Do you like water? Yeah. I guess you like 70% of me. <laughs> Do you think I can get your IG? Uh, sure. Wow, that one actually kind of, that kind of worked. Excuse me. Do you watch Stranger Things? Mm -hmm. Um, I was about to say, it's like, it's the strangest thing because I don't have your phone number. <laughs> Do you, do you know what do you know what this is? Uh, well, it's, a, it's like an old, old phone. Old yes, phone. my phone. Do you think I can get your phone number? Uh, I don't know. Why are you carrying that around? Is that your I think there's nothing that a girl responds to. Ever? I mean, every <laughs> everyone knows that girls love props. They love props. They love when you bring a big physical prop to hit on them. They do. They appreciate the effort. I'm sure a lot of women can attest to this in the comments, right? You want random guys to walk up to you during day-to-day -day life and not only hit on you, but hit on you with a big fucking rotary phone from the 70s. And that's the lesson here today, folks. So use props. That's the lesson. All right, you know what? I didn't I didn't get to the good Riz. We just watched the bad Riz. So if you want me to do another video that's just focusing on the good Riz videos on TikTok, then let me know if you would like that by liking this video and leaving a little bit of a comment and, or maybe comment your favorite prop in emoji form, okay? Okay, thank you so much. Or, um, sorry, or, um, maybe, uh, you, uh, um, uh, okay. Uh, so, okay, signing out, or, um, make sure to follow, or, follow, or to hit the link in the, dis or, uh, fucking, if you, um, bye. you should, or, bye, bye. bye. What would you do? Yeah, yeah.